some kind of light bluish green tinge. Who knows what that is? Powerade, Gatorade, watercolor, it could be anything. Everything's being pre back right now. We'll always do a thorough pre vacuuming of everything before we get started. This right here is my main concern. I don't know if this is going to be furniture stain or it's just watermarks, uh, pH imbalance, maybe it browned out. It looks like maybe a piece of furniture or a piece of wooden furniture set right there and somehow the floor got wet and the stain from the furniture transferred into the carpet fibers. Got some really black, bad black staining right there. We're gonna be trying some Magic Bullet. That stuff is amazing. Let's see what that does for us. And then we have this room. And in here, same thing. You can see a lot of areas of wear where the carpet fibers are a little worn out. Obviously they're full of soils and stuff, but a lot of times they look dingy because where you get all the traffic at, those dirts and soils become embedded in the fibers and then you walk on them and kind of grind those dirts and soils against the fibers and it abrades them. These fibers are made out of plastic. This is a polyester carpet. So it scratches it and it changes the way that it reflects light and it can make it look dingy. <clears throat> You see how matted down and worn out those fibers are here compared to how they look fluffy and nice here. All right, so we're finna get ready to start pre-treating everything. I'm gonna wait until my assistant has thoroughly vacuumed everything and then we'll keep you guys in touch. This room we had that really bad blue stain or whatever it was over there in front of the window. 